Like I always tell y'all, man, let's do some research. So I'm on my computer right now. I'm doing a little research into uh, the medical symbol. Um. So, like I said, it's a, it's a lot of things they didn't teach us in school. It's a lot of things that I don't know about certain things. So I have to go and do my own research. So this the symbol is called the caduceus if i'm pronouncing it right and um it's the symbol it's on the side of an ambulance it's in medical hospitals you know with the little ride with the wings with the two snakes you know what it looks like um yeah so in greek in greek mythology I'm, I'm looking into some Greek mythology right now. And, um, it's, it's, it's supposed to resemble or, um, have the meaning of the rod of Asclepius. It's supposed to, uh, that's supposed to be what it is, I guess. Because the rod of Asclepius is supposed to be, uh, it's supposed to symbolize healing um, in medicinal purposes or what, what not. But uh, they say it's sometimes confused with the Caduceus. And if you take some time and do your own research and put the two symbols side by side, they look different, slightly different. Um, the rod of Asclepius, it only has one snake. No wings, none of all the extra stuff that the uh, actual Caduceus has. The Caduceus is known as our medical symbol in, in America, right? So... Uh, you know, like I said, I was doing some research and I'm doing further research and it comes to find out that this rod was carried by a Greek god, excuse me, y'all, <clears throat> a Greek god, um, by the name of Hermes, it was a staff that he uh, that he carried around. He was known as uh, the messenger of gods, and also, hold on, let me see, because something else struck me about this guy, and I'm gonna make another video about that once I do all my research. I'll be I'm just trying to make sure I got, you know, all my stuff together before I start talking. Um, Hermes, he was an ancient Greek god of um, trade, wealth, luck, fertility, animal, um, husbandry, and sleep, language, thieves, and travel. I'm sorry, y'all. Um... He's supposed to be one of the most uh, clever and mischievous of the gods. So, anyways, um, so I started to ask around. Have you ever heard of this guy? Um, and uh, my girlfriend actually told me he that what what I found online was actually correct of what she knows. Um, uh, what she said it saying was give the boatman his coins or the coins or something like that. Anyway, she's supposed to have been like um, the conductor that leads souls into the afterlife. And to me, I mean, 
that that's what I mean because I I know you guys know about the clothing line, the brand, uh, guys and girls they wear the belts and stuff like that. And like I said, most time we 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 wear shit and we follow shit and we don't even know the true origin behind shit that we do you know what i'm saying like i would have never thought of this if i wouldn't have watched this certain video i had watched that made me want to do some more research into it but anyways yeah he um he's supposed to be like a trickster and a soul guide to guide souls into the afterlife and I'm just wondering why weren't we I mean I guess we can't expect these people to explain this type of shit to us I mean if they put it out there most followers and these bots and shit they gonna buy it motherfucker ain't trying to look up nothing and see see what nothing mean But that's crazy. Because at one point, I wanted a belt. I wanted a a Iron Man belt. I heard um, Jaden Smith talking about it in one of his songs. Um, Lil Baby was wearing it in the picture of him and um, Kamala. Like, and we already know what these celebrities do. And this guy, he, come on now. Do your research, man. This guy made sacrifices. He made sacrifices with humans, animals. He was a trickster. He, In my opinion, he was a bad guy. Period. And this... And this staff and this rod that he carried... The caduceus... It's our fucking medical symbol. Now, people may not look into that and, and 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 look at how I'm looking at it, but it's like, how could you get that confused with the original rod of healing? <clears throat> how could you know you know because the original one, which is the rod of Asclepius. I think I'm pronouncing it right. It has one snake. It doesn't have wings. It's, I mean, that's crazy. But like I said, this was just me doing my own research and just realizing that some shit was weird. And knowing how they get down and how they put shit in our face and hide it in plain sight. This could very well be something hidden in plain sight to represent some demonic shit. Because I don't see how the two were confused. I mean, y'all tell me what y'all think. I'm just I'm just thinking right now. I'm just doing a little brainstorming. I'm just, you know. But, you know, y'all let me know what y'all think because you got to question everything. You got to question everything. Like I said, you either a person that thinks and questions shit or you a person that just rolls with anything. Anything goes with you. Anything these these people put out, you gonna roll with, cause you a bot. Period. <laughs>